Hello everybody, and welcome to the much-awaited episode 12 of Let's Play Battlefield Somalia. Today we are continuing our battle against the American foe. Laggier than ever, but nonetheless also more determined than ever. However, before getting too far into this video, I would like to make a brief statement. If the Third World War happens to break out during this following weekend, my regular upload schedule might get slightly interrupted. I apologize in advance for this, and I hope that you understand. On a related note, I hope that you all had a very happy Easter. I sure know that I did. And now, we're going to go into battle against a gang of American gangsters who believe that they can try to subdue Somalia successfully. This, however, is an extremely mistaken belief and we shall prove this right here and right now. Unfortunately, this lag is getting me very angry. And I don't like being angry. I don't think that anybody enjoys being angry. And therefore, I am going to vent my anger by firing upon these American apostates. That was clearly a miss. So let's go and get this Abrams over here. Let's charge the American lines and let's break through. Let's achieve a victory for freedom. Real freedom. The freedom that is called for by the brave General ID. The Americans are continuing to come in force. And by the way, I probably recommend watching this video in 1.25 speed to basically alleviate the lag. Anyhow, we've regained our control over this abandoned farmhouse and we are going to go even further into battle. We're charging in and we're blowing up. Those goddamn tow missiles. Every single motherfucking time. Well, that's life. Love it or hate it, that's life, and we are going to deal with it. We're going to get back into our T-62 tanks, and we are going to bring some more misery to these representatives of Satan. Let's show them how we do things in our dear homeland. In the name of the great general, Muhammad Farah Haidid. The Somali National Army shall prove its mettle. Allahu Akbar! We shall defend not only Somalia, but all of Africa from these American imperialists who are vainly attempting to enslave this continent once more to their neo-colonialism. Now let's do this. Let's finish off this duel against the American Abrams, which is attempting to ram me. Okay, let's let's start reversing. Hopefully we can reverse faster and he can advance. Crap! There we did it, we did it! Victory is at hand, but we've got to continue stopping these Americans! They've seized the abandoned farmhouse! We are falling back! We are under heavy fire, under heavy pressure, but we, the Somali National Army, will not yield. We are the militia, we all are the rebels, we are the professional fighting force, which shall save this country from the abyss. Now here we go. Perhaps we might just sing a song on our way into battle. I'll improvise a little impromptu patriotic anthem here. In the name of the great general, Muhammad Farah Haidi, we fight 
For our dear Somalia to be freed We fight for liberty We fight for this indeed We fight for every Somali to be united and free And so we shall fight without fear We shall fight till victory is near we shall vanquish the Western evil in the name of the free Somalia. I apologize for being off tune. I also apologize for the fact that that song did not have a tune. It is a quick impromptu improvisation and I thought that I might as well just treat you all to it while it passed through my head. Now let's get back into the combat. Back into the battle that really matters. Back into our brave attempts to free the Somalian nation from the yoke of American slavery. Our goal today is, above all, to stop this convoy of US Marines from breaking through our line. Because, according to recent reports, we have somehow managed to encircle an entire division of US troops. Such an opportunity cannot be allowed to pass. We must fight fear fear fearlessly, we must fight determinedly, we must fight readily to sacrifice all in the name of our nation, in the name of our victory. Now the Americans are pulling out all the stops in this battle. They are bringing out their Abrams, their Black Hawks, everything in the name of their neo-colonial agenda. But we are not ready to stand by and let this happen. So we are going to hold this line. We are going to hold this line even if it's the last thing that we do. We are going to tear these Americans limb from limb, metaphorically and metaphysically. And nobody, I repeat, nobody shall stand in our way. We shall hold these quarries and their valuable resources. We shall hold the Somalian nation together. We shall win the ultimate victory against Bill Clinton's cronies. We shall put an end to Western perversion, to Western decadence, to Western dominance in this poor country of ours. Your suffering, dear Somalia, shall soon end. The battles which began in the, at the end of the Siad Bari era, when we overthrew the dictator and plunged our nation into chaos, these battles shall end. Our dream of a free Somalia, united and prosperous, shall come to fruition today in our battle against these American demons. Not a single inch of sacred Somali ground shall be yielded to them. Not a single inch of our nation shall be allowed to fall under the control of the Yankee imperialists. Now here we go. We're going to go for one final charge, one final attack to end this battle, to regain the initiative and thus to win the war. The US Marines don't stand the ghost of a chance. And we're going to knock out their Abrams. We're going to cut through them like a hot knife through butter. All three of them right here. This convoy will be destroyed by our single T-62. With this superior Soviet engineering, we shall above all take away their attention from the brave brethren who are busy behind the lines, taking their faces, subduing the American forces. Their endless stream of Abrams tanks shall dry up here, on the battlefields of Somalia!
We shall take them. We shall defeat them. We shall make them taste a defeat that they haven't seen since the days of Vietnam. They will be forced to report their defeats. They will be forced to report their crushing at the hands of the Somali National Army. At the hands of these brave fighters in the name of Allah. We are the new Mujahideen. The new Fedayeen. And to our sacred battle, we shall assure Somalia's freedom. Even if we lose today, even if we lose in a hundred more battles, we will win this war. Because there are more Somalis who are ready to die for Somalia than there are Americans who are ready to die for Somalia. Now let's run into battle one last time. Kalashnikov rifle in hand. We will not accept defeat. The Americans have momentarily triumphed, but their victory shall be fleeting. The Somali National Army shall soon triumph in every domain. I would like to thank each and every one of you for watching this episode, and if you enjoy the series, do not forget to leave a like and a comment, and to subscribe to my channel. New subscribers will receive the complimentary gift of a bag of fresh Somali khatli. The offer lasts only as long as this series, so make sure to grab it soon. I have been the Nerd Gamer, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next episode.